Welcome to this uh, session, parallel session B, about FIPE. Um, the first thing that you are going to do is to, uh, to open a, fold, fold, a folder that you have in your screen, that the name of the folder is USB, and inside this folder, there are uh, three uh, files, okay? I'm going to share with you, with uh, the rest of the of you, uh, the the link to download these three files uh, through through the um, team session, okay? So entering the team session for our for for you. So uh, the, um, this session is going to be a, a bit a bit chaotic, uh, but uh, I'm I'm trying to uh, to show you uh, to show you um, some ex only some examples, okay? And uh, to I'm going to tell you how to uh, to do some. Uh, um operation uh, particularly in in the open bin quantities with a model built uh, already built okay this is a cpcat map we say and here we can check the standards uh, where is it? So I I only can see here the, the Spanish one. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, and the language available uh, for this software. The language is uh, are here is Portuguese, Spanish. Uh, we have uh, installation for Argentina, Mexico, uh, France, English in English, Italian, and these two should be should, should be, I think, from uh, for Israel and um, maybe Greek. This is Greek. Okay, so uh, I, I think this is not the the right uh, uh, software, but uh, uh, later we will open uh, the the uh, the one that I told you for the uh, 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 thermal analysis or energy analysis. Okay, so uh, I would like to uh, do open. Uh, CP architecture. I'm going to do the same steps as you. So this this uh, small and very simple uh, model is is a, a house uh, with uh, ground floor and first floor, and uh, is made in this um, in this program. 
uh, we we pretend with this session uh, to have a, a bill of quantities with uh, using a, a cost uh, database uh, in order to to have a, a small and a small budget of this construction but not for the the whole construction only uh, some elements as the uh, the slab in the foundation and the the columns okay so uh, now if you you have opened this uh, this model and uh, i i i'm asking you to to turn on the all the layers okay this this is um, sim, uh, is similar to revit uh, only in the structure we have here three different um, folder or windows or yes the first one is a sketch that is for um, draw uh, shapes the second one is architecture uh, here is where we can uh, we can enter uh, some uh, templates in uh, DWG uh, and uh, we can create here uh, several views, uh, the typical ones, uh, ones for one per uh, floor, per level, okay, and uh, one, uh, vertical views, not plan, vertical views also, for the, all the, the faces of the building and of course the 3D uh, view. Okay, uh, here in, at, at, the, at the top, uh, in the um, left uh, side here, we have the levels manage, uh, management and we can introduce here the level, for example, we can edit the first one, level floor, that are the, uh, uh, the height of this level is uh, 3.2 uh, meters. Okay, uh, and we have uh, in the 3D model, in, in the 3D view, the name of these um, levels here, uh, floor second, floor first, and floor uh, number zero. Okay, but uh, Okay, here, here in this uh, folder uh, called architecture, we have uh, also uh, the way to enter elements, or, uh, vertical ones, horizontal ones, opening, that means doors or windows, okay? Also connection, that means uh, stairs, and uh, other, uh, okay, other commands uh, to build the model, but uh, we are not using that uh, today. Uh, I'm going to ask you that uh, enter here where uh, where they uh, here say uh, bin server center, okay? And we are going to try to upload or uh, no, no up the update, uh, yes, uh, no, share. We are going to share uh, this model and when when we press uh, we are going to press here when we press here uh, mm, the program acts as about Okay, we, we are going uh, from here to create a project in Bin Server Center. Okay, so uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure if uh, you can see this uh, window. No? Is different the window or? Yes, warning. Error. Uh, 
So uh, the first step is noted. So uh, it's connected uh, to our connected. It's connected. So we need to here. so uh, the, the the step is not uh, share share the project is uh, update okay this uh, icon uh, 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 in this way okay we are we we can uh, select an, um, a new project so uh, here uh, with uh, project selection with this icon we are going to create a, a new project okay uh, and you, you you need to enter your uh, nickname and your password of this person okay yeah. so uh, create a new project uh, with the name that uh, um, um, very important things here. The name is up to you, what you want. Uh, I'm going to enter uh, ha, uh, house, house 5. Very important things, the type of, uh, of project. Okay, you have to select educa uh, educational project. Okay, because also this uh, software is free. The educational project, if we select educational project, we are going to uh, be able to use the second software that is not free, but uh, okay. but is uh, it, it works with educational project projects. Okay. Uh, if you want to uh, to select not visible and man uh, management of collaboration request, uh, it doesn't matter. Open or close, that uh, is the same. Okay, so uh, press OK, accept, and we. Uh, So now we 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 have create created our project. Uh, it's it, one of you in in your account of Bin Server Center. So we can uh, accept again. And now the second step is to uh, share the project. Okay. And. Um, <laughs> The uh, setting the project is uh, when uh, the IFC uh, file is going to be sent to the uh, to be server okay? because we need to do that in order to use the model in the second uh, project. Second so okay, so press uh, okay, press uh, after. Uh, 
how much storage does have this problem? And then uh, the bits of the trunk travel manual space will have been on server. It's a uh, server. The, the server. Yeah. Uh, they said, I think uh, before uh, there was uh, the, the most limits, but not now. And the really um, the files are in IFC and but uh, I think it's it's now not now. They are the beginning days, but not necessarily. I I'm not the the so I think Okay, so uh, before nice. opening the second uh, the second software, I would like to to show you. Uh, one thinks of this one, of this uh, software with uh, with this model. Uh, if we uh, now uh, occult everything except floors, okay? Except uh, floors. Uh, where, what, where, where is the, 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 the ground floor? The, the, the round slab is, is not, in, I don't know the. Ah, here. Screen. I don't know. I didn't know this word. Screen. So um, I would like you to to select the uh, the foundation slab, okay? D double click, and uh, here in this um, windows and also in this uh, table here on the uh, right uh, side of the screen, we have some uh, description, okay? Reference level. Layer and in in the uh, here in description uh, we we have a losa theme that means a slab theme. At this I I enter this uh, name. This name uh, can be edit here, okay. And this is a, a tag. Really, is a, a, a tag, a, a label, okay? Uh, that is uh, um, necessary in order to uh, to use the second program in an easy way, okay? So, if we have elements with this reference, uh, later we uh, uh, we we are going to be able to uh, select the elements. Uh, easily. Okay, so we have a reference here for this slab and also for for other for other slabs. Uh, forjado, I I named it, it as forjado. You can change if you want. Okay, that's that's all what I uh, wanted to uh, to know of this uh, model. And now we are going to open the second one that is uh, is called uh, open bin quantities. Okay. Okay, and now here we are going to um, to create a new a new project in in one bin quantities. Okay, we are going to to do the work uh, since the beginning. 
sincero. Okay, so the name, uh, the what you want, and not, never mind the the folder where uh, is going to be uh, saved. Okay, so the name could be the same uh, house uh, house five for me. A any name, five. Okay, five. Accept. And, and now, because it's a new project, uh, it's the moment to uh, link this project with the same project in this cyber center. Okay. So we are going to choose select project and uh, the project that you create, uh, you have created before, uh, should be in the list. In my case, is house five. I, I am going to accept and accept. Um, okay, I, I didn't, I didn't set, uh, I didn't set yet the uh, the model. So and now I I can't see anything. But you you. Sorry. 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 Okay, so now we have the, the model here and we we are going to uh, to do a small budget uh, taking the quantities of the model, okay, with uh, with the price, uh, final price, final cost of this, uh, of the construction uh, of this element, or some elements. Okay, the first, what we are going to do is enter here, cost database, and um, yes, here uh, uh, um, in the in the Windows call quantities of the beam model, and in the icon that is uh, located uh, in the left side. Uh, here. Okay, 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 okay. I Esto es cuestión de final del futuro, ¿verdad? Well, okay, so here in inside cost database, we are going to import to create a new one and to import the 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 um, database in BC3 format. So 
the first what we are going to do is uh, add a new database okay add the, the name that i'm going to choose is house think house five and here uh, you can see that uh, you have the the option to set uh, to import from here to import a, a bc3 database okay so this is what we are going to do and you you have to select one of the of the file that i i i, I sent to you with with the pen drive in my case i, I store this um, where where is it this here open bin quantities practice okay this is the folder and the database that i i would like to do to uh, to import is a uh, house okay house open as that so now we have here the new database uh, with the name that you entered uh, house 5 and we can select house 5 and um, also we can edit the database and this is a database a, a database with price uh, prices uh, with uh, only two uh, unit works okay that one is in the foundation folder that is the uh, reformers co concrete foundation slab this uh, unit is the execution of of the slab uh, of the foundation in the foundation and we have uh, only another uh, more uh, work units that is for the concrete of the uh, columns okay of the pillars of the of, of this building and these two uh, prices or these two uh, unit works in the budget is uh, we have to link it with the elements in the model okay so this is all right we can add, uh, 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 accept here and uh, close the database but uh, be sure that the you have selected the this database uh, cost database okay Okay, uh, so everything is okay un until now, I think. Okay, the, the next step is uh, that we are going to, to do is enter here in where, uh, say, sets of measurement, uh, measurement rules. Okay, we are going to create the, the rules uh, that is. Uh, uh, what what we are going to do is only link the elements model with our budget in order to the program read the quantities and join these quantities uh, in in this case the volume the yes, the volume of the slab and the volume of the columns uh, so it's going to be linked with our uh, cost database. So we are going to create a new uh, set of measurement uh, rules. Out of five. And uh, we are going to choose now import the structure of these uh, rules, the structure from a, a data uh, cost database in this with this format so we have to again select the same the same file that you uh, to have in your in your pcs uh, here in the files that i shared with you i shared with you 
the, the, again, we are going to select the same database, house, okay? Open. And accept. So now, now here we have the same structure with the same chapters of the database, uh, the cost database. No, que no me sale lo de las rules. Las ah, reglas de medición aquí. Es que como lo tengo en español, conjunto de reglas de medición. Ahora aquí. Aquí. So next, the next step is um, edit. In order, uh, press edit in order to to can do, do things here. Um, we have to, to create to add a new rule. We we are going to call is it uh, call uh, pillars. Pillars, pillars. Uh, uh, I think it's double L in English. Pillars, vale. Está claro. Okay, and now let's go to select. Uh, the elements uh, called pillar pressing here in the in the sync of zoom this cross and now uh, when when we uh, find in uh, in cipe uh, these arrows in in blue color means that we are lucky because uh, Cipe uh, help us in this uh, work. So we are going to press the uh, the arrow, the blue one, and now we are going to select uh, entity because this property is uh, which we are going to use for select uh, for do the selection of the pillars. Entities here. Okay. And now uh, we are going to press the second arrow, blue arrow, this one, and we are going to select IFC column, columns. Accept and accept. Okay. Okay. Uh, everything okay? So the next step is um, join this column with the price of the column, of the pillars. And for that, we are going to press here, where uh, it, say, it uh, says assign codes, okay? And now a new uh, window is opening, but uh, maybe it's, uh, it's a bit uh, hide, hide it. So you, you have to move to to yes to to can see the database okay and now we are going to the uh, to the uh, chapter number five and we are going to select this price in the budget 
uh, the, the only one that is in, inside the, the chapter number five that belongs to the concrete of the pillar of the pillars, yes. And now uh, we are going to press add here with the, this icon, add. Okay. So everybody arrive here to the windows. Si lleva a ver si lleva HDMI, pero no lleva el HDMI. A conectarme doble pantalla, que no me llega a la vista. Yeah, and now again we are going to use the, uh, the blue arrows, but now uh, we are going to um, looking for the quantity, okay? The right quantity uh, of the element that we selected before that are the columns and uh, we can uh, enter here a lot of quantities and uh, enter here a formula but in this case uh, we don't need to operate with the quantities we are going to uh, to go to uh, to the section number b and with this uh, blue arrow we are going to select uh, net net volume, okay? Net vol volume in order to get the uh, cubic meters. Yes, the cubic meters, the volume of the uh, pillars. Uh, accept and uh, accept. Okay, and now. Uh, Theoretically, we have uh, we we have now joined the quantity with our the price in our budget. Okay, and we are going to create the second rule for the slab for the foundation. Um, in this way, we are going to press here to add a new rule, and we can enter here foundation. Or other work, what, what you want. Okay, and now uh, again, we are going. To, we have to select in this second uh, rule. We we have to select now the slab. But now we are going to use not the entity. But the um, the sketch uh, type name, okay? Type name. Yes. Okay. Type name is the the label the or the tab or the label, the label that we entered in the previous program in this element, okay? And this is the way to select it, this one. And we are sure that this, this one, uh, the element or the object that is selected now. And here we have to enter now the value of this type name that, that is in this case, a uh, LOSA theme, okay? That means a slab, foundation slab. Los afin and accept. Okay, so now we have uh, selected the uh, the slab in the model, and we we need to uh, link with uh, some price that we have in the chapter number four. The concrete for this slab is here, so we have to. Select here this one and press this uh, and press add here. Okay. 
And now we arrive again to one the uh, windows as as this one, and we have again to select the um, parameter called net uh, volume that is uh, the volume netto is the volume without uh, collision. I, I don't know. Uh, in order not to take into account this uh, uh, some volumes twice. So net volume is the right one, the right one. Okay, uh, up step and up step. And uh, we have uh, two prices and two kinds of elements. So the rest of the work is uh, repeat the same uh, process, uh, process, okay? And we are going to accept here and uh, select the uh, this uh, set of rules, okay? This uh, set of rules should be selected uh, in this way. Okay, and we can now close the this window and have a look at what happening here. What is happening? If we go to the uh, uh, to the class IFC columns, we can see that uh, now we have this uh, square uh, squares in uh, green. Okay, and if we select one of these or the whole uh, class. We, we can see that the, this, the color change, okay? And this means that we, we have joined uh, quantities with the cost database for this element. And we can do the same for the slab. If, if, if we uh, se uh, select the slab in the uh, 3D model, uh, we can see that uh, this element now Floor slab is also in uh, green. The this icon, the square icon is in green. Okay, so we we have now joined some elements with the data uh, database cost, cost database. And the, the the following step here is go into the bill of quantities section. Okay. Uh, in this uh, in these windows, yes, this here. Uh, enter there uh, with this um, uh, part where we can see the model. Uh, we can press this uh, this icon for uh, that is called 3D orbit in order to move the model. And can uh, we can watch it in in 3D? Okay. I don't think 
We are, we are going to to uh, to open a windows here um pressing here uh, this one in order to, to watch this part of the of the 3d uh, vision okay on, only to to have this open and now we are going to calculate the the budget okay and this the, for this uh, <sighs> Propose uh, we are going to use this uh, this uh, button update the quantities. Pressing here. Now we have to cost uh, build quantities. So, uh, pressing here in update quantities, we are going to open this uh, windows and we have to uh, select delay the previous bit of quantities and uh, a set of uh, measurement rules, selecting this one cost database uh, and selecting the, the one that you, uh, you have uh, uh, created before okay in the case in my case uh, out of five okay and we are going to accept uh, uh, this uh, windows okay 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 <laughs> um accept uh, import finished Okay, don't worry because uh, I I miss uh, a, a previous. We, we can configure it again. So you should you should uh, see in your screen something like that. Uh, with uh, we have now a, a budget and a small one with only two two element two, uh, two kind of elements. Okay, but. Uh, but now we are going to uh, to go here uh, general parameters to enter some some uh, numbers here okay general parameters is is uh, an icon here in at the top in the uh, left side and here we are going to enter euros for the coins for the currency Euro, okay. Uh, in in the tab of decimal, uh, everything is okay. And in percentage, we can enter um, okay. We we can enter the the following uh, uh, numbers. Uh, contingencies. Uh, 2% uh, general expenses uh, yes general expenses uh, for example 13% uh, 1 3 okay and industrial profit 6% okay and uh, Anything, anything about reduction the uh, co uh, reduction coefficient, coefficient uh, uh, zero is okay. The second one is uh, thir thirteen. So is the the first one is two, the second one is thirteen, and the first one is six. And now we are going to add a tax. Uh, tax 
Okay, and we press add and we are going to enter a uh, bat view v uh, at. Okay, but and for the bat we, we are going to enter here 21 percent. Uh, not 12, 21. Uh, VAT is uh, IVA in English. Vale, and the number of percentage is 21%. It will be, well, I don't know if it's a place, but here it is. Vale, so we have now our general parameters enter affect and now we are going to to calculate again uh, we are going to update the the quantities with the same in the same way the, uh, we are going to select the late the data of the current bill of quantities and uh, select uh, we are going to select uh, a set of uh, measurement rules and a cost database OK, the one that we create before and when we press a step, the numbers change. OK, uh, we have now a budget. OK, we, we can check this this part, this part of the that uh, of, of the window. These are all the, uh, the, the total amount of the budget with the percentage of the budget that we enter. And now, uh, now uh, I, I'm going to show you uh, how we can check if uh, which element are uh, are included in our budget, in our bill of quantities, uh, which element of our model. So we can press here, okay, in order to uh, yes, this one here. Yeah. In order to show this, uh, uh, visualization, visualization mode that uh, you can see with uh, tra uh, with trans transparency or no sé cómo se dice eso, pero puede ser tan fácil como tra transparency or, or something like that. So if if you select the um, the prices here in the budget, you can uh, you you can check that uh, this uh, this uh, unit board uh, correspond with the columns or uh, with the elements with some elements in, in our uh, in in our um, model. Okay. So. Um, and now what we can do is to update uh, the model in Bin Server Center in order to to have uh, this information in the I in the IFC uh, model in Bin Server Center. In, in our project, in, in our account of Business Center. And to do that, uh, to do that, to do that, uh, maybe in the previous, yes, in the previous uh, uh, tab, in, in the tab called quantities of B, uh, quantities of the bill B model, and now we can share, okay? Update means uh, bring information. Uh, share means uh, upload information to the to the bin server center. Okay, and um, so bill of quantities uh, in in this uh, format is going to be uploaded, and also uh, bill of quantities report that we we didn't generate this document before, but we also can share. We are going to press uh, uh, step. So our database with our uh, prices and our quantities is now in the in, in the uh, Binser Center. 
And now uh, I'm going to show you how to uh, obtain the reports. In this uh, tab, bill of quantities, in this section, reports, okay? And uh, maybe the, the nice one is, uh, uh, yes, is this one. No, uh, this one could be the. Okay, uh, let's go to to try. Okay, this one is an option. Is uh, price bill quantity. This is a, a budget. And now we have only two uh, chapter with two prices. Uh, and we have the quantity, the price, and the amount of uh, of uh, euros. And there are there are also uh, more detailed, uh, maybe detailed place uh, with so the complete description uh, in the summary. So now we have the the complete description of the price. So. Uh, as happen in in any uh, budget uh, software, uh, we have uh, we can uh, uh, produce or export the report reports with our budget. And this uh, tomorrow for the session of uh, tomorrow, uh, a budget of. Uh, uh, um, the whole house, not this house, a real one. OK, uh, you are going to use the budget, the bill of quantities in order to. Uh, uh, to. To carry out the LCA analysis. Of the materials of this uh, house, OK? So. Okay, this is the, the one of the practice that I I want to uh, to show you. Um, I think uh, what we can we can do now is uh, I I would like to show you the the software for the thermal analysis. I, I'm going to show you the same because. Uh, with this software, we can check if the the walls, okay, the envelope of the building, uh, the uh, partition uh, are according with the standard, with the uh, with the el, el código técnico. Mm. Okay, uh, but before. Uh, I would like to share the uh, a presentation for uh, especially for you, okay? Uh, that you are you are uh, doing the, uh, the 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 bachelor degree uh, thesis uh, of this this project. I'm going to to share uh, quickly a presentation. That I saw, uh, I uh, saw this uh, morning. Uh, in order to to tell you only some some things. Uh, okay, uh, this is the workflow that you are going to use. CPK first, uh, you, you can from CPK also create a, a project in Bin Server Center and to share the information in order to the, the IFC model go to Bin Server Center. Okay, after that, you can 
uh, open uh, feedback feature uh, you can uh, upload in order to well, create here you can see uh, in, inside uh, uh, feedback architecture and uh, you have to enter the walls here the walls and uh, yes and even the the floors because the floors you have to enter again the floors uh, because the floors are uh, built of layers one layer is the a structural uh, slab, but there are more layers, and you have to enter a floor with uh, this uh, height, this uh, uh, special but, uh, dimension, but also with the dimension of the uh, the rest of uh, material in, in, um, on the. Uh, on the uh, structural floor, okay? So you need to enter a new floor with more height than the structural one, okay? And you have to enter here all the walls. And the walls that you have to enter here uh, have not uh, properties, only that are walls of this thickness, okay? The thickness that you enter, okay? And later, you have also to uh, to use this one uh, at the same way. You you have to share uh, the model uh, here in order to go uh, to insert center and open this other program uh, and update the model in order to the model go go back to the to this program. And with this program, you can enter the uh, properties, the layers of the walls, okay? And you, this is a library and you can choose a lot of uh, different kinds of uh, envelopes and partition, okay? And in this way, is, is uh, how you can, you, um, you, should, you, you, you can uh, create the whole model. Uh, in the opening, so the windows and the doors, you can enter here, but here uh, again, uh, the object has no properties. Uh, there is another uh, program um, which one that, that is a library of openings, a library of doors, uh, where uh, many uh, Manufacturer has uh, the, the, uh, their products in this library. This library is, uh, is this this one is free. This one is not free, but never mind for us because uh, we are uh, using an educational pro uh, project, and no problem is going to uh, we we are not going to have any problem as the same. Uh, the same happened when with open wind quantities that is not free, but because we selected a, a project, a educational project, uh, they, uh, the, the, this program uh, didn't ask uh, for the license, the license, okay? So uh, these two programs are free, uh, the program of the doors and the windows are not free, and this is uh, neither it is, but uh, with a rational project, uh, it works uh, with, with any any problem. Uh, and now, uh, uh, I, I have I, I'm going to recommend you a tutorial of this. Uh, 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 program that we we uh, we did in a previous uh, project, and I'm going to show you, show you um, uh, this tutorial. If you enter in Google, if you enter uh, BIM BET three. 
Enter Big Bet Three. Okay. This is the web website of our previous project that uh, uh, CityCon, uh, where Cristina and Marina works, uh, was uh, uh, was also a partner of this previous project. And uh, I would like to you uh, enter in uh, Beam tutorials. And uh, let me uh, let me check if uh, no, uh, Romanian is is here in everywhere because I think so. Uh, so any case you have this in English. Uh, and yeah, it, it, this is uh, Romanian. Okay, so with uh, Google translate automatically, and in our experience, uh, between English and Spanish is quite good, and between English and Yes, uh, Portuguese is uh, all right, uh, and others, other languages. Um, yes, I, I think I, I have to 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 say that to to Maria Pop that here, if uh, they are thinking in teaching BIM in in Cluj Napoca, they they can use this BIM material. So. Uh, Let's uh, let's go to to the block number number seven. Okay, and here we can go to uh, contents, and we can uh, go to this one: being model with CP architecture. Okay, we can select um, the first the first uh, page and after that I recommend you that uh, move move in uh, you can move inside the this tutorial using nest and previous okay because uh, here the navigation area is is not uh, working in the best way so uh, with nest you can uh, navigate with, uh, um, through the through this tutorial, okay, and the uh, here we explain how to install the very easily the the software, uh, and after that, you want to go to after that you you have uh, a, a description of some steps that uh, you need to do to create a new project, to create the project in being server center. And you have here an, an overview uh, of the program and also. You have uh, here three uh, videos. Uh, OK. Some instruction you you, uh, you only can Download the templates in CAD format. In order to uh, you can use this uh, uh, CAD uh, files to guide the construction of the model. And uh, some uh, dimension in th thickness uh, in meters of the uh, of the elements and now uh, three uh, videos. And for example, the first one is is an explanation of the program, but the the second one is uh, the steps ha has the the steps that you have to follow to in order to build the model. Okay. For example, I'm going to uh, to show you to show you a, a part of this. Uh, video and in order in the record can uh, can get the 
Uh, I have, uh, yes, uh, I'm going to go here, I'm going here. Yes, I, I'm going to share my screen again, but now uh, I'm going to press here, include here, no. I want to uh, to share my screen, but including sound. Okay. Anyway, doesn't matter if uh, if they the people online uh, can't uh, listen in the video because they know where the video is. Okay, 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 okay. We start by creating two floors of 3.20 meters and 6.40 meters elevation level, respectively. So this video shows how to create the, the views, the plant views and the elevation views how to create the levels, how to uh, load the templates the temp that, and how to use the uh, elements or how to uh, introduce the elements in the model. It's uh, a bit uh, fast, uh, but you can stop and for the floor the zero, video. you choose the appropriate template. The language is English, the but draw grid has been uh, deactivated to have a better display of the templates. English. We proceed with the columns. Its section has no variation, so it can be completely inserted. We continue with the external facade and the internal partition of floor zero. Choose the height and the thickness. One thing to keep in mind is the way it's going to be introduced. Now the internal partition. Its height is 2.95 meters due to the subtraction of the floor slab thickness, 25 centimeters. We proceed to insert the screed. The way to insert it is below the surface. On floor one, we insert the appropriate template. 
insert the beams on this level. So, I, I recommend do this tutorial uh, for 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 you for uh, for who is going to to, to carry out the um, the work or or the uh, bachelor degree thesis in this project uh, in order to after uh, do this tutorial uh, i think you you are able you are going to be able to uh, to build the the model of uh, your house okay your uh, uh, single family house that you have to model okay and and now so now I'm going to show you the uh, the software called uh, Tipeterm e, e Plus in, in order to uh, to show you. I I didn't use this before. I, I'm going to use it because it's uh, very interesting. Uh, the Spanish version is free. Uh, so the, the name of the Spanish version is not the same as this program. Uh, is also FIPE, FIPE term uh, HE. And this one is FIPE term E plus, E plus. OK, and we can show you this uh, through an example that uh, we can enter here from here. Office building, okay, office building. Okay. So we can hear only three three tabs. The first one is building. The this is the um, we we need a model. We need to um, update a model from Bing Server Center. A model in this with this format in uh, IFC format, and this uh, model. Uh, should ha should uh, include uh, the properties of the material, but is not uh, uh, is not necessary because we can add these properties from here. Okay, we can add the prop uh, properties of the walls, of the envelope, of the building, of the roof from this software. But we need a a, a model. A 3D model with uh, information. At least I'm going to to show you. At least uh, with information about the spaces in each of the rooms of the house or of the building, and this uh, space, the uh, volume of uh, the just the volume of the space inside a, a room in the in the building uh, uh, have to be uh, added in, to the model with this software. Okay, open B analytical model, and this one is also free. And this one uh, take uh, upload upload the the model from uh, PPA architectures or from uh, Revit, also from Revit, or from another, uh, yes, uh, an EFC built from uh, with another software. This uh, software is only to upload if you have the IFC model. You can upload to a project in this server center with this one that is also free. So the IFC model uh, can come 
from any software, any one. But we uh, need to enter the information about the spaces with this software. Before use the, the software with, uh, which is going to carry out the uh, thermal analysis and uh, the energy analysis. Okay. So now we have uh, imagine we have here with our IFC with the right uh, information about the spaces and uh, about the walls, or we can also change this specification of the walls here. For example, external walls. Uh, so um, when we end, when we use uh, the software for construction uh, system, we enter the layers of the uh, walls. Okay, and we say uh, we said there if this wall belong to the is an external one in the envelope or is in a partition or an internal uh, uh, wall. So he, from here we can change the properties or mm, or even uh, change yes change or add the properties to the wall. So it's not necessary uh, the library previous library because here there is a, another library. Okay. We can, uh, for example, we have here two kind of wall in the uh, two kind of external wall walls. If, if we edit this one, these are the layers, okay, and the the properties of each each layer. For example, uh, air space. Four centimeters of uh, wall air space resistance. So, is this uh, number two layer the, the layer number two? Is if uh, uh, air only air uh, an air camera? Okay, and for this air camera of this thickness has the conductivity conductivity of 0 0.26, uh, uh, I think this uh, batios uh, divided by meter and Kelvin. This is a. Uh, is what? Sorry? The, the, the name is? U. 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 Ah, U. Yes, the U value. Uh, the conduct, okay. OK, the U value. Uh, I think thermal resistance is the R, R, R. The L, OK. The density is a property of material uh, and the specific uh, height, heat. And this is all the uh, values uh, needed. OK, but uh, we uh, realize that we have here another um, blue arrow that means that uh, CIPE help us. This is the library of, uh, uh, of goals. We can add uh, stood goals, I, e, IFS, uh, brick goals with uh, a lot of uh, thickness and layers, okay? And if we import this kind of wall, the properties is going to be uh, uploaded here, OK? So for this analysis, uh, analysis uh, we need properties for the walls, for the yes, uh, conductivity for, for the roof, uh, the envelope. Also, the, uh, the partition is necessary to know the, the properties because depending on the use of the uh, of each uh, a space inside the building, we, uh, the, these uh, spaces is going to need, uh, are going to need uh, heat, central heat, or, uh, or not. Uh, so, opening is very important. 
And for example, this this one is uh, uh, here. Only two these two parameters are necessary. Uh, the U and the uh, well, and solar coefficient or or more. <laughs> I, I'm not an expert in this kind of analysis. Um, okay, if in the model we have uh, the opening with uh, all the properties, we can uh, show it here. But uh, we can yes, if uh, there is, here there is no any there is no any blue arrow as uh, we have with the uh, <coughs> with uh, with the walls. But uh, we know that the the U in openings the uh, maximum level of uh, Mm, transmission coefficient or uh, yeah. just uh, the U, the maximum value of the U in openings is two or one point, I think is two in, in our standard. Okay. And 0 0.2 for, for the walls. So we, we need to, uh, to select. Um, properties uh, um, walls with this uh, uh, value of the transmission uh, uh, heat tran transmission co coefficient less than this one. OK, uh, information about the. The spaces, OK. Because uh, we have to say if this space is going to be occupied by people or not, if this space needs uh, heating and cooling. And uh, here are the um, the comfort standard in uh, yes, in heating and cooling. That came from, from the standards. OK, and uh, the other information needed is the um, energy system. That uh, again, we can choose uh, from a lot of uh, system with a lot of characteristic. Um, the model uh, need a location. Here you can locate the or, con, uh, or check the location or change the location of the model because of the uh, climate in this location. OK, and because of the orientation of this location It's not the same to uh, uh, looking to, to the north or to the south because of the uh, shadows and also because of the uh, insul and yes the the hours with uh, without shadow. Uh, okay, so uh, look nice. I, I never uh, uh, perform some uh, analysis like this, but uh, I can understand what is needed and the results for the results. Uh, um, okay, we 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 can take uh, plans or drawings with the information of our uh, elements. Okay, and here there are a lot of uh, uh, drawings with uh, the information about the spaces, the use of these spaces. Okay. And um, I think so. And we can calculate the salary of each case to the window. Okay. Um, 
Um, I'm not sure. I, I what I, I what uh, I'm sure is that with a wet or no, is that we uh, we can from with this software calculate the the breaches, the thermal breaches, the, the um, part of the building with uh, some difficulties in yeah, the weakness. I don't know what the witness, the witness of uh, the witness uh, uh, that usually are in the win yeah, windows or the... yes, uh, in when when you join the uh, slab and the wall, this yeah. uh, this line is yeah. is a witness, and this uh, depending on the uh, on the material and the joint. Uh, this software can calculate these uh, properties of this uh, line of the, the witness thing. Well, can I calculate how much heat uh, windows uh, through the window blazing heat the the sun the sun? Yes, I, I yes uh, yes uh, I, I I think so. I I, I think so because uh, so here. Mm. I'm sorry, not trouble. I know see skylights. No, I don't know. I I, I don't know. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But uh, I I it should because uh, uh, because it is is just for 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 the for this. Mm -hmm. So from from this window, from this uh, tab, it can it's not analyzed, but we can analyze the the the, the engine. Yes, the engine is energy plus engine that is uh, uh, is free and is. Uh, it it works with uh, is an international uh, prestigious uh, engine for this uh, for for carry out this analysis. Okay, and um, and what I I can show you the the result. This is what I found in the uh, in the web because each one of these software have a web uh, and a, a website only uh, talking about the the each software and Pipe Ten Plus has a, 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 their own uh, their own uh, page that is this one. And in the uh, yes, in the results we can found that there are a, a report for the engine demand report that is uh, related with uh, uh, with yes, with a lot of things, <laughs> and the energy consumption also. There are also an analysis about the con, uh, condensation of the wet in uh, of the humidity inside the internal one inside the walls so i think um uh, i think that we are finishing our session uh, I have no more prepared, but I I, I recommend you that uh, you 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 have to do the the tutorial the of uh, CP architecture.